Get Prudential's Pro Review. It's fast and free. There's a special place where a dad can look back and a kid right. can look ahead yeah. together with lots to see, lots to do, lots to share, and all with the same college spirit that's been running through America's veins since the pigskin first floated across a crisp October Saturday. It's the College Football Hall of Fame in Kings Island, Ohio. And it's something special you won't want to pass. He began his career as a Boston College quarterback when he entered a lost game against Penn State in State College in 1981, October 10. Now, he is, of course, the most prominent player in the country, and the Eagles trail Penn State 17-10 again in State College. One of the great stories in this college football season has been... A chance to make sure both my loved ones are cared for. At Prudential, we know most of us don't get a second chance. Talk to a Prudential agent and get the peace of mind that comes with a piece of the rock. I'm here. Get a piece of the rock. Prudential Life Insurance. football, the All-American game. The Prudential Halftime Report has been sponsored by Prudential for Life, Health, Auto, Home. Get a piece of the rock. Prudential Insurance. After one half of play, Penn State 17 to 10. What are you change on Penn State's side? Nothing. Tell them we're going right after them just like we have, and their defense against a normal football team would make it fatal for Boston College. But Boston College is not normal. They got Doug Flutie, and he's going to be harassed and pressured more, I think, than he's ever been before. And if he doesn't make the big plays, they've got very little chance to win this game. But he's going to have to throw the football out of a crowd of people. He is not going to be left alone. We know that. One look, and sometimes just a half a look, and throwing, rolling, and scrambling, trying to run for his life. A perfect defensive plan. Only Doug Flutie could get, keep him in the ball game. Well, they broke the one big play by Bell, but other than that, the running has not been that much. Those four defensive men are penetrating and causing problems. Bell's run was an individual effort. You tell your defense, don't worry about that. He wouldn't make that run again in 15 years, and he probably wouldn't. No one else would. Stick to our game plan. We are pressing him, and we are doing exactly what we wanted to do. I know this is probably, in the case of Doug, an unfair thing to say, but if he does pull this ball game out, I think that'll lock the Heisman Trophy for him. If he doesn't, it may still be alive. Well, he's, he's my Heisman Trophy choice because I've seen him for three years, and I think that goes into the voting of many people. He's a, just a phenomenal football player. But if he pulls this out, it's going to be by his individual effort with a little help from his team. Okay, now let's spend a moment with the Penn State Marching Band. We're not going to have time for a post-game score show for you. So we're going to roll in the scores of the top games across the country today. But and try not to let it detract too much from this one. Third down and seven. Come on now, Doug. And now this one reads past as Crane drops. Pressure's on. They've got him scrambling. And they go. They don't get it. He got out of the hole. And turns the first down for Penn State at the Boston College 39. Without question, that's the biggest play of the game. He was in bad shape back here with the blitz, but his Frank is a senior. He's been there before. Pereira, number 41, had a chance, missed him. Now we see Holly, oh, number 53, I guess that's the freshman. Romanowski. Romanowski misses the tackle. Strang, big and strong, makes the critical, very important first down. Oh, that's a backbreaker at 623 to play. In the football game. First down for the Lions on the Eagles 39. Come on, come on. Now they can run it a while. DJ Dozier hurdles a man, breaks it big. Touchdown, Penn State.
Rocky Washington made the big play of that run as he knocked Todd Russell out of the play and Dozier took it in from 39 yards. Let's watch it again. You'll have a chance to see Dozier. Joe Paterno says is, has the best instincts in an open field of any player he has ever coached. And you can see why. Washington and 29 there. just makes a great play, delays Russell enough that he could not help on the, could not make the tackle. Now the team to play, they want to make it a 37-23, a 14-point difference is what they have in mind. Well, they've got trips to the right, an unbalanced line to the right also, Keith. They're going right. Frank's pass. Good in. Complete. Who was it? Washington? Rocky Washington. Big run by Strang when it appeared that Boston College had him trapped. He got away. Dozier took it 39, and now watch this shot. All, Do all Strang is looking for is one receiver to get open, and you can see that Washington had hooked in between the linebackers and cornerbacks. was wide open, and the ball was right on the money. Now that extra point that uh, we could have kicked earlier with the 13 points behind might make a difference. And now uh, Penn State's bull fortunes perhaps are improving with each passing second. Very good the defense. Flutie just is sensational in knowing where the receivers are, what the defense looks like, and here comes the blitz. There he is, too. Slides down. Flutie gets away. Now gets the pass off, and it is Strahan caught it. Yes, he did. Too. My gosh, how did he catch it? Sensational play. This is what we've grown to expect in watching Doug Flutie. Uh, the late is a fantastic, a fantastic exhibition. I agree with Joe. Never have I seen a better performance. And you see where he's over the 10,000 yards. No, he needs three more. Oh, I'm sorry. You go over? Yeah, I, don't, I don't think he needs three more. Flutie's pass into the end zone. Martin, touchdown for Boston College. Well, he's over 10,000 now for dang sure. <laughs> Four minutes and five seconds to play in the football game as Flutie rolls and drills Kelvin Martin for the TD. Now they go to the last timeout, I think, after this play, if they stop him short of the first down. This could be a million-dollar play right here for Boston College. Right? Yes, it could. Spring runs away from the crowd, gets the first down. Doug Strang, for the second time in this possession, squeezes out a first down for Penn State with 125 to play in the game. And they can run the clock out now. Only one time out. They do not have to punt the ball. They can fall on it. Penn State freshman, just a half of a game in 81, coming in as the quarterback. Plays and watch the clock wind away on you. But uh, Frank, you're right. The Penn State people put their game plan together and played hard. Flutie was sensational. The first 10,000 yard man in Division 1A, 10,003. And uh, they're going to lose their second game of the season, having lost by a point at West Virginia. Penn State's going to beat them by a point here at Beaver Stadium. And the Nittany Lions now will go to a record of six and three. Boston College will have a record of five and two. And there is no more time. The game is over.